Hello everybody and welcome back to some more Voidiger. We are jumping in again and I'm honestly, I unlocked a new character, I think, if I remember correctly. Yeah, this one. I'm still going to play as this guy again. I had so much fun as him in the last episode. I want to play as this guy again, but we are going to go for, by the way, I've been told that this other item is insane as this guy, but I still really like the gym bot. Um, and then, yeah, I'm going to use this booster scythe. It seems interesting. Um, I'm not exactly sure how it'll work. But I'm gonna give it a go. It seems to be melee, which I like the idea of because this character seems pretty cracked with melee. It is indeed melee, nice one. Everything. Um, and hopefully, using that, we can do some interesting stuff. Right. Just running around at the minute, trying to pick up as many of the little crystals as we can. Keep moving. Oh, I still love that teleport area. Boom. Ooh. Ooh, damn, yes, I like that a lot. Okay. That's a weapon I can get behind heavily. Holy hell, that's a lot of fun. Okay, nice. I'm down to climb with that. Like, this is a really good pairing with his ability. Like, this just works so well. We get a second weapon here. The Stealther, the pistol, it's fine. Do a challenge room here as well. We got gun... Faster reload or another sword. Was this the sword that I got last time that actually shoots? Don't stomp on anything. Let's try it. Why not? Look at that. Instantly dead. Very good, very good. Oh my lord. This weapon just makes things easy. I love it. There you go. We got this as well. So, is this a melee weapon? I can't remember. It's So, this is the thing we had last time. I'm going to take it because it's technically better, but um, I don't remember it being all that good last time. But then again, I was using it against high-level enemies, so... Um, go with a beacon barrage during battle. Why not? Why not try that out? We can save the thing for the boss there. Second. Right, let's keep this moving and grooving. So far, so good, though. The uh, durability on our weapon seems decent. Oh, we're finally going to finish one of these. We did it. Let's find out what the hell this means. Using world tokens. You have collected enough world tokens to unlock a new area in this world. After your run, head back. Ooh, and use the world explorer. Expander, even. That's going to be like an alternate floor, I guess. Or just a new floor entirely. I don't know. Either way, I like the idea behind that. Seems very good to me. Back over there for some reason. We do have uh, one of these here. Um, is this going to go away at some point? Okay, yeah, I want to tr trade rooms. Right, let me grab that real quick. Put it into the weapon smusher. Put it into the weapon smusher. Get some ammo and some health. And take the ammo for my durability of this weapon at least. Oh, also, there's some things I need to do in my settings that I forgot about. Right. We're going to my settings. They added some new settings for skipping certain animations of things. And so I think I want to do some of that. Um, I'm guessing it'll be on gameplay, right? There you go. Auto skip viewed boss cutscene. Auto skip essence get and auto skip upgrade. The the boss uh, cutscenes are interesting. Um, but I'll be honest, I skip them anyways. So having them all auto skip saves me some time. There's me having to skip them myself, which I'll be doing anyways, so... Quite like it. Look, look at that killing power. What the hell's... Okay, that, that wasn't anything. I thought it was something, because it was, uh... Wouldn't die straight away. Nice. Almost upgraded this weapon. Where'd you go? There you go. You stayed there. Nice. Yeah, all good. One of these already. Nice and easy. I'm guessing our boss will spawn at any moment. Good thing we can just hit through shields as well there. So that's our boss. Wait, so... It didn't auto-skip there. Did I not save my settings then? No, I did. I did. Not quite sure why that didn't auto skip it. Or maybe it didn't, I just was spamming it while it was auto skipping. I don't know. We we'll see how good this weapon actually is now that we're fighting an early game boss with it. Yeah, it's 
pretty good. I wonder, like, how many of these I want to be getting in terms of, like, the barrage thing and stuff like that. Are they, are they something I really want to be going for? Like, I think that's much better. Wailing on him with a melee weapon. Not gonna get me through there, boy. Yeah, not gonna get me there. Okay, so we'll, we've all ta we've tapped this out. Good, give me those crystals. We got another weapon smusher here. Don't need to use right now, but good to know it's there at least. And we actually got our last one right here. Nice. We can actually now kill the boss. If we would so like. Nice. Oh, God. I, I thought I got him there. Damn it. My bad. Lost a little bit of health out unnecessarily, but it's okay. My boss is now in play again. Good. Okay, boss is here now. Remember, we've got two phases. For some reason, I always forget that. Nice. Oh, dude, this, this sword is, like, really low range, I just realized. Maybe that is why it was doing such a bad job before. sit on top of that barricade thing. Okay, yeah, I think it was just that I was too far away last time. It's, it kind of seemed dog shit. I think if I'm really close, it does a lot more damage. I think it actually scales its damage based on distance, you know. I seems to be doing a ton when I'm dead up close. I think the actual, like, firing mechanic also swings the sword, which does some damage itself. Can you stop moving, dude? I want to get up close. So, yeah, I thought that would auto-skip. It doesn't. Maybe it'll start on the next floor. I don't know. Melee double attack. That sounds interesting. Let's find out what that does. I'm going to guess it just me melees twice. Obsessed Poltergeist has noticed your prowess with melee weapons and decides to learn from your ways. They might not hit the air with the same power, but we all start somewhere. Interesting. Okay. Uh, we haven't actually seen the shop on this floor. We've only got 20, so it's not a ton to go with. But we should at least try. At least try. Yeah, his shop. Quickly crack all these open. Up to 25. Nice. And we definitely give one of these away. 80 is so valuable. Right, let's have a look. All bullets are now rockets. I've had that before. It was amazing. Um, instant corrupted upgrade bundle. Laser on block. Faster sprint speed. Take the faster sprint speed. I think we'll leave it there for now. Right. Good to go to the next floor. Beautiful. I think that went really well. That went really, really well. We can just keep on moving. Right. See if there's anything here we want to trade, but I, I highly doubt it. That, that hasn't been super valuable in the, in the past. Trade weapon for power up. No, thank you. Max HP again for bundles. Very risky on only one health. I am tempted though, but no, I'll say no for now. And go on to the next floor. Echinos are the apex predators in this domain. Indomitable. Until you arrive, that is. Indeed, until I arrive, that is. Really small rooms here. Kind of weird. Oh, I used the wrong weapon there. My bad. I meant to use my spinny blade, which I absolutely love. This thing with the double melee might be really good, actually. 
Hey, we get another new area here. Still don't know exactly how this works. Soul boot attack, trade weapon for power up. No, thank you. Weapon for power up is one that's really good if you can get some excess weapons, but otherwise, ain't really my style. Yeah, this double this double melee attack is kind of awesome. Seems really, really good with this weapon specifically as well. I like that quite a bit. Cracking everything I can. Taking out the enemies I can. I mean look at that like AoE that we've get that we're getting with that. It's crazy. Here's our boss. Am I bothered about the boss right now? Kind of. So we're all out of sight. There's a lot going on in this room in terms of this, what this boss is doing. Ooh, I, 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 I think he's in our rockets as well. Look. Our bullets and our rockets, remember, so we're seeing the knives, blades, should I say, not knives, but seeing the blades kind of like just chilling out next to him. Kind of interesting. This thing's doing so much more damage, though. Oh my god, that thing's insane how strong it is. Crack this open. Good. There's some durability. Very much needed. Thank you. Oh, these are some of the enemies that we can just hop on top of, right? Yeah. No need to waste stuff on those. I'd like to find the shop here as well if I can. I love that quick movement. There's the shop. Good, good. So, ah, me and makes No, thank you. Right. Definitely want an upgraded gym bot. That was really good last time. Faster rocket acceleration will also take that. Yeah, let's try that out. Why not? Seems to be like a rare item of some kind. Ultra rare. Yeah, why not try that out? I've no, I don't think I've, I think this might be my first ultra rare. Unfortunately, we can't take on your challenge at the moment. Good. Quickly check in here. Do not dodge. Man, whatever this is. I'm gonna take that. Oh, of course I can't stomp on enemies because the gravity is so high. I was like, why aren't I stomping? I can't stomp. I want to stomp my new button, but I can't. Oh, I like that. Right, magic hat is going to replace this, I think. Yeah. And then... Melee lasers we had last time that I really liked. Okay, then we can get out of here. We can quickly grab back that and then go... Like this and go to... Th this one that wanted my... Yeah. You wanted my sword for the boots, so I'll do that, yeah. 
Okay. I'm getting there. I'm getting there. Thank you. I'm going back up to this room, which the boss is now in, which isn't ideal. I'm going to get my magic hat back. So I don't actually know how this works, but I'm, intri I'm intrigued to find out. Got a few huts in here. Challenge rooms and the like. Ooh. Speaking. Now, let's go for the upgrade. Uh, blocking and attacking runes spawn. Uh, oh, okay, I see. Yeah, that's fine. Oh my god. A little bit hectic. Did manage to get hit once there. Okay, we got there in the end. Took a bit of doom, but we got there in the end. I'm gonna go for the extra acceleration here. And then we've got... Bullets, knockback enemies, expanded block, and stompable snake bullets. We'll go with the buttons, sorry. We'll go with more buttons. Our booster site is out of ammo, but I still want to keep it. I might even go and buy some ammo from somewhere. A lot of weapon trade-ins here. Let me quickly know that you're enemies. Right. Let me buy ammo for that. Holy hell, you see that? That's awesome. What the hell's going on there? I don't know what's happening, but I like it. Right, quickly grab this. Come over and into... Where's this little hut that I went into before? Is it gone now? Am I... Have I confused myself? Wasn't there a hut right here? Is that hut gone now? <laughs> that hut's gone now. I'm confused. I'll be honest, I'm confused. I thought there was a hut with a weapon trading thing. It must have ceased to exist. My bad, I guess. Give me that back. Right. Where the boss is, I think. Yes, it is. Ah, there's the last thing here. I didn't even realize there was one left. This is crazy. There's so much going on right now, it's kind of hard to follow. Why is the boss somewhere that's like, I can barely see it? Boss, would you like to... Make your way back over this way, thank you. Oh my god, I love this combo of items. It's going absolutely wild. Got them. Okay, he has moved now. Luckily, the easy to follow. This is where you're stopping? Yep, good, good. Hello, big friend. We are here to murder you. Oh, he's doing this attack a lot. There you go. Nice and easy kill. Right. More ammo there. Gym bot. I want to upgrade you again, I think. Almost got him to max. Extra HP here. Um, We could technically go and do the challenge and grab the, uh, the mama, wherever she is. Uh, mama, where are you? Go here. I will fetch your thingies. Oh, wait. I've just thought. What about if I have to go to another floor? Will she just appear on another floor? I haven't really thought this through, have I? Uh, right, no. It's it's fine. It's fine. Um, If I go back over here. Over here. Buy some HP. And all I need is one more HP now. Can't be that hard to find. 
Is there another one around here already? There's gotta be. Apparently there's another one in here, actually. There it is. We did it, baby. We did it. Awesome. All we really wanted there is the maximum HP, but the durability is nice too. God, this shortcut area is the best thing this game ever did. It it wows me. Here we go. Next block. But damn, for some reason this run feels like it's been going for a really long time, even though it's not. Max HP for random bundles is good. I actually will go for the magic hat for an upgrade bundle. I think that's a very good idea right now, considering we've got a few things off max, one off max upgrade. Sadly, didn't get either of those, but melee mimic seems like a good upgrade. Got no thanks. Do I want to trade max HP here? Yeah, I, I do. I do. Melee Mimic again, I think. And then we've got... Melee Weapon Shock Enemies. Yes. And then we've got Bullets Become Herming Orbs. Or Banana Attack. Let's go with the Herming Orbs. I've tried that before. It seems pretty good. Let's get out of here, and then obviously we have to get a gun to work alongside this now, because we've just got rid of our gun, but they come pretty fast and loose, like, they're, they're all over the place, so I'm not really that worried about that. Speak will penetrate the frozen tundra, a painful task <laughs> Oh my lord. The damage that we are currently dealing with our melee is quite obscene. Quite obscene indeed. Everything dies. Oh, I've got one of these in this room. Nice. I didn't notice that. Look at that. Dead. I love the little RIP there. <laughs> right, keep this going. Just gonna have to worry about durability right now. Durability is not in a great spot. Luckily, the game does kind of give you a lot of what you need, but um, we'll just have to. I wonder how much that hurts you for. It can't. It surely can't be one full health, right? Right. We do have our shop here. Um, got another one of those there. We can get this up to max upgrade for fifteen, which we definitely should. It's useful, but also we'll get an extra out of it. That one was instant. Beacons boost attack speed. Let's go with the beacons boost attack speed. That seems useful. And then we got 43 left. Grenade on reload. Shoot more one more time. Stompable grave buttons. You cost 15. Let's take whatever this is. Bat-a-tat-a-tat. It's just a bat-bat. Okay, seems good. I'll take it. I like the glow of that. It's all these things. It's so nice. Good. Oh, dead. Oh my god. I just, it just creates so much crazy shit. Nuts. Defeat all enemies in less than 30 seconds. Not done? Oh, you're still alive technically, I see. This bat gun is terrible. <laughs> yeah, this gun is unfortunately pretty bad. Snake egg launcher. I've just got the crab boots, so I'm not going to get get rid of them straight away. Yeah, sadly not great, but here we go. Let's carry on. Oh, that, de that deal is still available, I see. I thought the weapon was just free then. I was like, wait, what? 
I think it's bad because of the combination of items we've got, honestly. Just making it act kind of wacky. For max HP, that's a definite yes to that. That is a pretty good thing to get. Max HP for that power up. Not even a very good power up. Ooh, we got a Scythe here. Do not get hit. Scary, but we'll we'll see. Putting up defensive shields. Nice. So now we can take the scythe. Which I'm going to take over the booster scythe now, I think. Nah, I'll take it over the bat thing. Weapon gamble. Increase melee durability. No, I'd rather take that one. Nice. Let's keep it going. Don't know how much of the boss's health bar we've got unveiled so far, but we'll figure out right about now. Okay, not a lot. I think maybe the um, homing orbs thing isn't doing so well for us. What the hell is this? Oh, this is the boss. For a hot minute, I was really confused there. Okay, well, we've maxed out the HP that we can do to him so far. One of those. Do not stop moving. Shouldn't be too hard. Yeah, damn, this is crazy combo. I got hit, but that's wasn't part of the challenge. It doesn't matter. Um, boot attack on Stomp, yeah, that's that. That goes well with that other thing. We'll take that as well. Thank you. We've got a bunch of enemies all over this room. We'll leave this room for now. I don't particularly care for it. Boss is still here. To be fair, we can probably do a bit of damage to the boss. Take off one of those bars of health. There you go. Done. God damn, this thing's good. I haven't really used the harvest scythe that much yet. I probably should. Keep moving through and just get all of our thingies done first, and if at least the boss shows up, we can get it all done in one go. Another world unlocks. God damn, the scythe going kind of crazy as well. And there's our attack speed bonus, I think. Right. Boss is still running around doing his own thing. No way to ever give this away. Oh my god. There's just so much going on on the screen when we hit an enemy. Kind of insane, actually. Ow. I get how crazy this boss is in terms of how much it moves around and stuff. Oh my god, the damage. You got these little pumpkins it creates as well. I don't know how valuable they are, but every little helps, I guess. Ow. Keep those away from me, please. Stomp on that as well, just in case. Oh my 
god. Having Jim bot at this level as well is helping a ton because I can keep my distance. Got hit by one of those Herming shots and got hit by the boss itself. There you go, we got him. Oh, stressful. We got him. I'm going to go with the, the charging pepper thing and keep keep growing that up. Seems good to me. Right, not much else to do this floor, I don't think. Um, maybe go back to the shop real quick and see if there's anything else we want to buy. Oh, we also got this here that I didn't take before. My bad. We'll get that. We'll get that. Cool. We'll take both of those. We'll skedaddle to the next floor. Let me just quickly check in here. It says we've got a gun on the floor here. Yeah, we do. We've got a gun there. And it says we have a muncher here. Yeah. Good, good. We also got this as well. Chance of dropping coffee. I don't know what that does for us, but I'll take it. Right, this is the last floor or this one before the last floor? I can't remember. Right, quickly just check what's going on in here. Sacrifice max HP, I don't think it's uh... Sacrifice max HP, I'm glad they bought that now. Max HP is very valuable here. Thank you much, Lee. And we shall go. That little mid-world thing so useful. God damn, it's so, so useful. So we are in the last stage now, I wasn't sure. Dissolving itself. The end again. Right. Try and clear out all of the uh, stompables as early as we can. We'll see if that's plausible or not. Not always plausible. Got a sacrifice room thingy there, little portal. Okay, we can stay alive through all this. It's a little bit hectic, but do not fret. Gotta remember, we gotta press the button every time we move between rooms here. Okay, boss is free to be killed now. I'm hoping that the setup that we've got going on should lead to a fairly quick fight, but I don't know. We do have some of the annoying bosses in here. I'm getting very, very overwhelmed right now. Very much doing the best that I can, but this little birdie boy does not help things. I'm trying to stay in the, the beacon's radius as well, so I can get some extra dude sky. Okay, we've taken... I just want to say, we've taken a ton of damage here. I don't know if we can live through this. Oh, unfortunate. It is what it is. We unlocked a few things there, though. If we go back to camp and see what these, these world things are. There it is. That's, that's the one. You can come over here. New World Expansion. Antlatis. Nice. Upon the horizon, dense clouds of spent explosives swirl, while famed raspy coughs and then we've got from within. Parker Land. A closer look reveals a landscape dotted And then we've got the North. Computers. Nice. Okay, we've got some good stuff there. Um, but unlocks, we've got 12 there. The horizon. A fiery Checking what else we've got. We've got 12 there. Backdrop. Don't know if we've actually got any other ones. So this might be the last actual physical expansion we're going to make. Which I'm guessing will be an another new character. Yes. Okay, so we've got all the characters unlocked now. Nice. We've opened up all of our home area now. 
Kingdom. We can start doing some interesting stuff. But yeah, hopefully you guys did enjoy this one. Certainly an unfortunate ending, but either way, hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next one.